Hi guys, Ali and Luke here. Today we have more mail. So we got some pretty interesting stuff in here that I need to show you guys because it's pretty exciting. I got so much work to do receiving all these packages. Now I think that we can really go wall to wall with the Ollie's room setup. So let's dig in. Ollie's busy over here on this piece of box. So I'm just gonna go ahead and we'll start off with this letter from Ms. Jill Blask. Oh yeah, you wanna open it? Come on in. It says it takes a special man to be a good father. You got that? It says, hi Luke, time flies so fast. Take it from me. I'm 57 and my daughter Maria Alicia is 34 and married. It seems like only yesterday that she she just started to walk. It's funny you say that Cohen took his first steps yesterday and we got it on video. So I will be showing you guys that later. If you want to see it, let me know. Let's see. I'm sharing a lot here, but I feel you and Pete are a great father to your kids. God bless you and keep you and keep you in his care. Love a terrific daddy for Xyling. You're a terrific father to Xyling and Coco and all. From Jill. Thank you very much, Jill. I plan to put this up with the, the other cards that I have that people have sent over over the space of this YouTube channel life. And I have them all on the thing, even the envelopes. Ollie's done something with the envelopes, so I gotta find it. What you doing, crazy boy? Huh? Hey, you wanna see some mail, too? All right, let's see what we got in here, guys. You crazy boy. All right. What's this thing? This is from Claudia Day, and this is looks like a little forger for, for uh, his cage. You hang it like this on the top. Check it out, bro. What you think about that one? Yeah, it's a good thing. Huh? You see those in there? He loves little hangers like this in his cage, though. He'll be playing with this for sure. Probably put this in for you today. Huh? You like it? <laughs> He's like, what is this thing? So I'll set that over there and let me get used to it. Also it has some squeaky texture balls. <laughs> I don't know if Ollie likes that sound. He's curious though, because he's looking around. He's trying to get over there to get on the light, but I don't want to jump on the light. There's actually some really cool textures in there. <laughs> yeah, I know that's a weird one. They all make Noises except this one. So this one I know is it's a forge. You put little bits of food or fruit in there, closes it up in the teeth, and then he has to get it out. Just like that one. Maybe like that. Yeah, there's even a little hole in there, so you can sneaky get something in there. Very cool. Very cool. Awesome little cage accessories that I I know is just gonna love, even if it takes him a second. It took him a second to get used to this orange line, and now he's all over. <laughs> Oh, your baby. Oh, now. Come back over here. Thank you. And this one. That's a cool looking coconut hanger, it looks like. Fun to chew and full of surprises. What you think about that? This is from, also from Claudia Day. So I guess these big box, the, the box, the rest of the stuff. Except one, I think, is from Claudia. He's trying to get up and get the drywall. So y'all, I have to scrape the ceiling off. I get all the drywall off. That's why I haven't hung any ladders and stuff. But it's really hard for my neck injury <laughs> trying to look up that way. What? You want to see it? Check that out. What do you think? What do you think? <laughs> he don't know. You're just trying to get the drywall off. This is really cool. So this is what I was talking about. It's a wall hanger. I'm going to get rid of this plastic. I was going to get over it. But you hang stuff on it and post it around. What do you think about that one? You liking that? There's little forging cups on it, little gears. It's really cool. And I think that this could go in his cage or in the playroom, but I think that I'm going to put it on the top there where he gets at the drywall to distract him. I think that that'll actually be perfect. So that worked out. Thank you so much, Claudia. <laughs> that worked out, didn't it? You want to see it? Come here. Come look, come look, stop being a chicken. Who wants to be up top supervising and look like? Come see, bro. It's got me all. What's that? What's in that? What's in that thing? Uh -huh. <laughs> I don't know why he wants to be up top so much for it. What you trying to do? 
trying to get into? Uh, what you trying to get into now? Ow! <laughs> yep, cloudy day. We have another letter. This must be the actual letter from Claudia. Here. Look at that thing. Well, this is a really cool card. It's Stonehenge Temple Observatory, Stonehenge, built in 2700 BC. Pretty cool looking card. Oh, wait. Off with his head. <laughs> it says, Luke and Ollie, hope things are going great for you. Just a little thank you for providing so many people moments of joy. Take care. Claudia, you see that, Oz? Look at this one. What you think? You gonna eat it? I knew you were gonna eat it. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. I gotta hang that one. I gotta hang that one. It's a, that, was, that one's really cool. It's probably one of my favorite cards there. Oh, wow. Now yeah, I was gonna try one of these. So these are Vitacraft Slims, and they're made of carrot and uh, vitamin A, like corn and stuff. So, let's see if Ollie wants one. You want one, bro? Yeah, I'm about to pack just two of so, you don't need the plastic, you crazy monk. Get it. <laughs> you don't like it? <laughs> it smells like a, like a guinea pig cage without the guinea pig. <laughs> you know, like cedar. And... It's <laughs> not it. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> no? That's okay. Even if Ollie doesn't like them, uh, I can bring them over to uh, Hootie and Ham, and they'll love these things. So, I got something for Monkey Boo's hamsters. <laughs> Ollie don't like them, that's funny. He was like, ugh, <laughs> and runs off. You just want the package, don't you? <laughs> he loves the crinkly. Let's see. Oh, yeah, so these. Came off of our Amazon wish list. These are perfect for keeping Ollie's veggies and fruits and stuff uh, longer without without molding and going bad. Really good little product. I don't know how it does it because it, fe it feels like regular Tupperware, but I guess the color. <laughs> you doing crazy? I guess the color of it makes them stay longer. It does baked goods, fruits, and vegetables. So I really appreciate this product. This is going to be very handy and get a lot of use through the whole entire house. Oh, like, what are you doing over there? You got you some Amazon take? You're a crazy one. I don't want to get this. Mess. Styrofoam is bad for monkeys. They eat it, it cause a blockage, and kill them. And it's no good. That's not what we want. So, I actually got some of these in use already. But this is the, the smaller box also. So she got the big box and the smaller box. It's really cool. Really nice of you, Claudia. I really appreciate it. That is exciting because I've been having the hardest time with the weird weather and the ups and downs and humidity to keep the food fresh and nice one. This one, there's a note in here somewhere. This is from Kim Merrill. Are you stuck? <laughs> Are you stuck? I might just loop that and have you sit there for me. You wanna hold this one? <laughs> Thanks. So this is a cool little bedtime, reversible bedtime blanket. <laughs> He's got the mail time zoo. He fell into the box. It's always funny because he's so little still. He looks big, but when you see him, he's really little compared to the box. He's in the ribbon. I knew he would. He loves ribbons too. Let's see. Um, I also want to say I have a big thank you to Debbie Muller. She sent us $50 to Ollie's PayPal for some new diapers, and that's what you're seeing on Ollie, that nice shiny new, i play with that one, yellow diaper. What was that? <laughs> He's all over today. Here you go, play with that one. So this is a cool new soft blanket for you all. So what you think about that one? Yeah? <laughs> I think he likes it, Kim. Thank you very much. I think he, hey, there's a box in there. Here you go. Get you some box. It's really soft. I love that powder too. It's got owls and monkeys. I thought it was just monkeys. Little owls, little monkeys. It matches you all. So a little owl monkey, I think. Come on. <laughs> you got stuck. 
All right, and then it's like last thing is this big old. This is a cargo net that you for kids to hang outside like off of a swing set. What I plan to do is hang it somewhere across on top. I just got to get this drywall off and find the studs. So it might be a while, but I definitely plan to hang it up because this is going to be a very, very enriching toy for Ollie. Thank you so much, Claudia. I know this was a pain to get here. <laughs> She's conversing me and Amazon was being weird about delivering it. And then they delivered it and didn't tell, tell uh, her. So thanks for sticking with the struggle, Claudia. I appreciate you. Last but not least, this is also, this is from Kim Merrill, I believe. Kim Merrill, I just said Kim. Royal Oak. This thing's real cool. So this is a big old tire swing. Damn, we'll have to figure out. Eventually I'll take that fan out and uh, put this where that is because fans are dangerous for monkeys anyway. That's why it's never on it's hot. But yes, thank you, Kim. He's gonna love it. I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna get this all up. I'm about to be so busy. Good times. Hi. <laughs> all right, you ready? Say thanks, everyone. Thanks for watching the only channel on YouTube dedicated to life, baby squirrel monkey. Please like and subscribe. Thanks again, everyone, for the mail.